Hello everyone, welcome to the video, welcome to the vlog. I'm actually gonna be filming another video today, so it's kind of confusing, but I'm gonna be doing one of those like however long vlogs there are, but also I'm filming a like do my homework with me. So um, we're gonna see how it goes. But today is super gloomy outside, you see it? It's so like gross and nasty outside, which is really, really sad, but I'm gonna be doing some homework. And like the way my structure is for this week is like really weird because my Monday class basically canceled-ish. Over the weekend, I usually spend the entire weekend doing homework for my Monday class, but since I don't have a Monday class, I'm gonna be spending my whole weekend doing my Thursday class homework because uh, our like final is due and I wanna make it good. So I'm gonna film a video about that today. I just wanna start the vlog today because I thought maybe it'd be exciting, maybe, I don't know. But yeah, so I have like a million and one errands I need to run today. So uh, first of all, I need to put my hair up because my hair is gonna be in my face for the entire day. I'm gonna be annoyed about it because I don't want my hair up. So yeah, but let me just explain what we're doing today. I need to go to Starbucks. I just ordered my breakfast at Starbucks. I'm gonna pick that up while I'm walking around. I need to go to the RISD store um, to get more polymer clay. And I need to go all the way to the mall, which is actually really obnoxious, but I have to because I need to get some materials that I only know how to get at the mall. So I'm gonna have to run there real quick. I need to get some embroidery stuff. We're gonna see how that goes. Why does it hurt so badly? Jesus. We're just on a hunt for materials today. I need to pick up a bunch of things right now. So what is this hair? Okay, I don't wanna waste too much time. Uh, I need to get socks on. I have these super cozy socks that I feel like are like low key fitting for cozy season. Um, it's not even that cold today, but I wanted to say I need to get running because I only have like an hour before things close. Um, so yeah, but look at my socks. They have, a little, they have a little angel wings on the butt. Let's get shoes on and get ready to go. Okay, okay, I got my wallet and Oh, I need my mask. Oh my gosh. And we are ready to go. Currently in the elevator, but first thing we're gonna do is go get some Starbucks. I'm gonna go pick up my order that I made online. So yay. Food acquired. And now we're gonna go to the Rizzy 3D store. At the 3D store. Where did they put their, oh. Oh well, found it. All right, so now I just got another bag of clay and now we're gonna walk all the way to the mall. How exciting is that? And now after a long walk, I have made it to the mall, yay! Exited the mall, oh my gosh. That was so exhausting, I was there for so long, but I got a bunch of stuff. And now I've made it home. So I'm going to film whatever it is I need to be filming and uh, I will get back to you guys at the end of the night because I'm gonna spend the rest of my night filming this video. Good morning, every- Oh, good morning, everyone. Oh, I need to open that. But good morning, everyone. How are you all? Oh my God, it's so bright. The lighting is washing me out. I did not put on the proper things to start today. Um, ha ha ha. I look a little less dead. These are things I don't normally do because I, I always wear a mask now, but you know, if I'm gonna look like this on camera, I think I'm gonna have to do something about it low key. But hello everyone. First thing I need to do today is I need to put up my hair because my, I, I'm, I'm not doing this. Can I do one more loop? No, I can't. It's always the question of, can I do one more or not? My necklaces are caught in my hair. Hello everyone. Okay, so. I no longer look remarkably like an egg, only a little bit, but today, first of all, I wanna show you guys a super cute cup. Are you seeing this? Not spons, but this cup is literally the cutest thing ever. I really needed it because I needed a bigger cup than my water bottle to stay on my desk because, you know, um, this motivates me to drink more water and it's so cute. And you know, it looks like boba, but I'm not drinking boba. I'm just drinking water because, you know, I can't sustain off of boba as much as I would like to. Look how cute this cup is. Oh my gosh. Anyways, I got that recently and I ordered it online and it just came in today. So I'm just really excited about it. Today, we are going to be running more errands as we did yesterday. Very exciting, I know. Also, when I first got that cup yesterday, I opened it up and there was a little star, oh, it just fell on the ground. There's a little star sparkle inside the cup and I was like, oh, cool. I have a super scrunchy 
in my hair. Very exciting, I know. It matches my top and we are going to go run some errands. So first thing we need to do as always is we need to eat some food. So with that being said, welcome to Tiffany's super janky college setup where I've been making eggs in this mini waffle maker. So that's what we're doing today. I've been making eggs recently. You can hear it sizzling a little bit in the background maybe. But I also got some bread recently. Uh, I haven't eaten bread since I've been home. I also haven't eaten eggs since I've been home, but since I just got eggs, I figured it's time, you know, it's time to get some bread to go with it. I don't have a toaster, sadly, so it's just gonna be a slice of bread, but that's okay, you know. Also, I don't know if it's just a family thing, but I've never seen bread tags until I got to college. Like, I feel like either my family just takes bread tags off and just like throws them away immediately, or we've never bought bread with bread tags on them, which doesn't make any sense. I don't know. One of my necklaces is really messed up. My necklaces constantly just get tangled within each other when I sleep, and it's really annoying, and I just have to undo it like all the time but that's okay love the sirens outside so the plans for today is i have to go and buy some snacks because i have not bought any snacks in a little bit and i just realized yesterday that uh the only thing i have to eat is cheez it's at night and i really want some sugary snacks sometimes so instead of going all the way to the mall like i did yesterday we are going to go to the local 7-Eleven, which we don't actually have where I'm from. So I'm like really excited every time I get a chance to go to 7-Eleven. And I actually haven't gone to 7-Eleven this year yet. So that'll be exciting. Yay, breakfast. Does anyone remember this waffle maker from like my freshman year at RISD? I feel like I used it so much freshman year. Also, I... I'm just so in pain. Like my shoulders hurt so much from just like constantly working that I'll just sit there and I'll just like massage my shoulders and it just hurts, like it's just painful. But whatever, it is what it is, you know? But yeah, I've been working on embroidering, you know, since yesterday um, and it's so exhausting. There's just so much of it to do, but that's, that's okay, we're gonna get through it. So for now, I'm just gonna eat my breakfast and we're gonna go CVS after. Okay, I literally, well, first of all, I need to find <laughs> my wallet, but I have no idea where my black face mask has gone. I know it's somewhere just in my room. I would just left my room without turning off my waffle maker. That would have been really bad. I have no idea where my black face mask has gone, but that's okay because I have disposable pink ones. I would just be wearing instead, but you know, I need to find it. It's definitely somewhere in my room though, so I'm not too worried about it. But let's go to 7-Eleven. So I'm currently waiting for the elevator, but I didn't realize that the 7-Eleven is open 24 hours a day which is really really nice because um i always get hungry in the middle of the night and maybe now i can finally go there when i'm hungry in the middle of the night the only reason i wouldn't go there is because i'd have to walk in the city alone by myself which is a little sketch so i'm probably not gonna do that but you know it's nice to have that option and to know that they are open because there's not many places near here open 24 hours everywhere here closes super early there's a lot of snow melting from the day before Oh my gosh, it is so bright right now. But I have not walked down the street in so long and I know it's nothing like New York, but it just makes me miss New York because I haven't been in New York in like over a year now. It's so bright outside right now. Oh my God, I can barely see anything. Where am I? <laughs> Successfully made it into 7-Eleven. There's some altercation happening outside. Uh, I don't know what's going on, but the police are getting called i'm gonna stay out of it and just buy my ice cream just providence things Just Rhode Island things. Situation avoided. I don't really know what happened, but I don't really care. I got my stuff. Just a giant bag. 
and we're gonna walk back to my room. Okay, so let me show you guys what I got. Uh, this is just some junk food. Don't eat like me. But anyways, it's a wildly unhealthy haul, I'm well aware. But I got some lifesavers. These are so good. Gummy lifesavers are literally like the best thing ever. Some waffle cut potato chips. Potato chips are so good. I'm taking a break from eating potato chips because they're so bad for you, but I'm gonna have them in my room in case I ever want them so I don't have to go out again. Oreos. You must have Oreos. Oreos are uh, essential for a balanced diet. Just kidding. I haven't had Oreos in... I haven't like bought a pack of Oreos probably since high school, honestly. I suddenly have a craving for them, so... Here they are. And then because of my newfound desire to eat bread, I got peanut butter and Nutella. And peanut butter and Nutella together are so good. If you haven't had a peanut butter and Nutella sandwich, go eat one right now, unless you're allergic to peanuts. Peanut butter and honey is also so good together. So do it. And lastly, it's just some haagen ice cream. I haven't had ice cream uh, in my room for like two weeks now, I think and I really miss it. And I want more ice cream, but they didn't really have any there that I want. So maybe next time I go to CVS, I will try to find some more. But yeah, I really miss, I really, really miss the ice cream from, you know, now that I think about it, I probably should have gone to this place called Serendipity and they have a little Asian section. I'm debating on doing that now or not. Do I go now? I'm gonna see how far it is from my room. I just checked and it's a nine minute walk, but you know what? I feel like walking today. So we're gonna go over there as well. Hopefully find some yummy Asian foods. November is when I really start missing home because, you know, I usually get to go home by this time, but I'm not this year. So I need some, some familiar foods and I miss H Mart so, so much. And you know, like I was thinking like, like dang, I should have just gone straight to serendipity, but this bag was low key a little bit heavy. So it's a good thing I actually came back and like dropped everything off. And now we're gonna go to serendipity. So let's go do that. I'm actually really excited. I haven't been to serendipity since last year before COVID. The weather is surprisingly kind of nice today. So walking outside is actually kind of fun and I haven't walked outside in a while. So it feels really good. <laughs> Finally getting some of that exercise that we need. Wow. This tiny little portion of a downstairs area, as you can see there's stairs right there, is the only place I found near where I go to school that has like remotely Asian snacks. I'm really excited. And now I got my stuff from Serendipity. I got their last box of Melina, the ice cream pops, which is really fortunate because they didn't really have anything else that I wanted. And then I got two packs of steam buns. I got the red bean kind and I got the vegetable kind. I got a big pack of those because I really hope they're good because I really love vegetable buns and I didn't realize I had them here and I never thought about it but that's such a like good college food because it's so simple you know. Oh more police. Okay I am now back. Also I realized I never showed you guys proper fits. I'm still not really showing you but I got these new pants. They're from Gymshark and I have these shoes I go with them. And look at these cool strappies. They have little straps on the bottom. So they're really, really cool. But this is the relaxing fit for today. So yeah. <laughs> but now that I'm back, I'm obviously gonna take off my shoes because why would I why would I wear shoes in my room? <laughs> but okay, let me show you the second haul of food today. I don't actually know if these should go in the freezer or the fridge. I'm probably gonna put them in the freezer because uh that's the safe guess, I guess. Um, but here's some red bean buns. They're green on the outside, which I haven't had before, but I mean, they can't be like not good. And then I got these guys, some jumbo japchae dumplings. They look really good. I'm very excited. And I asked my dad how to make these in the microwave because unfortunately I only have a microwave. So we'll see how that goes. And then, oh my gosh, first of all, this is like a mini box, right? Like melonette don't normally come in the small of a box, I feel like, but here they are posing with my baby. I'm so excited because these are just so good. I haven't had these in a long time. The last time I had one was at Korean barbecue because they gave us one randomly at the end of our meal. And since then I've been thinking about them, but at home I never have them because at home I eat like ice cream usually, but these are just so good. So I'm gonna put these in my fridge. Yeah, very exciting haul for today. And so now that I am back 
first of all, gotta take off my socks. I hate wearing socks. But now that I'm back, first of all, I need to drink water because, oh my God, that was exhausting. Stay hydrated, my friends. So for the rest of the day, I'm just gonna be doing some editing and some Twitch streaming. Basically, I just have to, you know, get my setup done and all I really have to do to get ready for Twitch streaming is just put on my headset. So um, I'm gonna go do that. I don't know what we're gonna play tonight, but if you wanna follow me on Twitch, go ahead. It's just my name, Tiffany Wang on Twitch, and I really appreciate all of your support. I've been on Twitch frequently recently. So if you wanna catch me on one of my lives, I will definitely be there and hang out with you guys. And I love hanging out with you guys on Twitch. So I'm always glad to see you all. Yeah, I think that's it for today's video. This is all we're gonna be doing. So I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and for running all these errands with me. It's been a very busy couple of days, but I really appreciate you guys being there with me. And I will see you guys in the next one. So stay hydrated, take a nap, and I will see you when I see you. And if you want to see me actually get ready for a twist stream, I made a video on that that you can check out on my channel. Stay hydrated, take a nap, and I will see you when I see you. Bye!